G'day Ben, Benji, Benny boy, whatever would say in Oz, something like that. I uh, heard you're pretty good at F122. Not sure if you're good enough to beat my time around Austin though, so give it a crack, see if you can top me. G'day mate, thanks for the challenge. But I have to ask, why did you wait until I was on the other side of the planet away from my sim rig to do this? Very tactical mate. But uh, you know, I had a go on the laptop and that went absolutely diabolically. But luckily, Here's a lap I prepared earlier. All right, here we go for a hot lap of the Circuit of the Americas, out of the last corner, open the DRS, and now we get ready for turn one. Very hard to spot a braking zone for this corner. The 100 meter board off to your right is your reference. Right the curve on entry to maximize the uh, the apex speed at the corner. On the power nice and early, short shift to fifth gear. Now we get ready for the S's, which is very easy to get caught out by. Clip as much curb as you can without touching the yellow sausage elements. That's going to destabilize the car. Keep to the right to fling in to the left. And uh, the same is true for this next right-hander. Stay as far to the right as you can. And it means you can get on the power and carry so much more speed on exit. It's uh, free lap time, basically. Heading into this heavy braking zone. Brake after the 100 meter board turn in. Nice and late, late apex. Get on the power nice and early. Avoid the curb as much as you can on the right-hand side. Short shift to fifth. Open the DRS. And now for a few seconds, we can actually relax. Use 50 brake bias to minimize the lockups. I use around 60% differential. Braking just after the 100 meter board. Mount the curb massively at that left hander. The uh, track limits are pretty friendly there. Into this right hander. Keep the nose into the right, short shift. Get over to the right because you're setting up this double left hander. Brake super late, turn in. Get on the power nice and early without wheel spinning. It's a very tricky and technical part of the circuit. Keep as far to the right as you can to minimize the distance traveled through here. And now we get ready for this very blind left-hander. Fifth gear, clip the apex as much as you can. And now stay as far to the right as you can to maximize the entry speed. And that is a hot lap of the US Grand Prix. Bit of wheel spin on exit. It is a very tricky corner for many different facets of driving. But we've just about survived. 1 minute 32.435. Just a casual 1.1 seconds faster than Daniel. Sorry, mate. To be fair to Daniel, a 133.5 is pretty damn quick for someone who doesn't play the game very much. If you guys think you can beat Daniel, have a go yourself. You can try F122 for free as a trial this weekend on PlayStation, Xbox, and Steam. So give it a go. Try the Ricardo Challenge. See if you can beat him. See if you can beat me. And let me know how you do. Cheers. <laughs>